When I was working with the Indian Arts and Crafts Board back when I was a teenager, one of the things that they commissioned me to do on the side when I wasn't even in the office, they just commissioned me to do this on this, on this, not on the slide, but just on the <laughs> side. They commissioned me to do 21 black and white pen and ink illustrations of traditional Cherokee basket designs. And by the time I got to like number 16 or number 17 or number 18, I'm thinking, I bet I could do this. Because, <laughs> you know, it's all, it's, it's, it's math, you know, it's about patterns, it's about seeing the patterns in something. And my family was all like, no, you couldn't. And I'm like, no, really, really, I think I could. No, you really couldn't. I really think I could. And so I, I taught myself how to do it all week. <laughs> And I, I actually learned here in the studio, and, and my dad's very ill in North Carolina, so I would go back and forth every 60 days, and I would pack this basket up, and when I would sit there with him, I would work on this duffel weave. And the way I did it was, you know, you hear stories of, I learned at my mother's feet, you know, all these little clippings would fall down there, and I just learned how to do it. Well, my mother doesn't make baskets, and so I would have one hand on the finished piece, and I would count, and I would figure out, okay, 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 I'm right here. And then I'd get on the piece I was working on, and I would count, and I would count, and I would count, and I would say, okay, 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 here I am. I need to go under four and turn left. <laughs> so <laughs> this hand would run over here and try to help this hand learn how to do it. And so I'd go as far as I could, and then we'd start over again. I would go back over here and count where I was and just keep going.